god guys this is the very last Colossi <sighs> good luck I'll pray for thou but then uh, this thing just came straight out of hell um, it will destroy you within a few seconds one wrong move or direction to follow and you die a most painful death what you need to do is hide behind the pillars guys you're gonna see that there's holes in the ground you drop into them and then you just follow the passage you just run baby run and climb up the next open hole hide you just hide guys you guide hide until you reach the colossi this is no jokes um stay close to the walls because it can still attack you it can still as you can see it can still see you so as soon as he gets like one millisecond of a chance to attack you he will um this colossi is straight from hell from hell like i said you need to stay behind structures yes there is a few extra holes for extra achievements to fall into to get to those old scars not easy not easy at all as you can see it just hit me but with one of the fireballs it takes you a while to get up and then you need to run again and it takes him a few seconds to attack again so guys um yeah and i glitched into the piece of the lock luckily he tried to attack me again look at my health guys uh yeah but follow the holes in the ground there is a stamina glowing thingamajig i don't know what you call it and it increases your stamina you're gonna need it i barely had enough they all over the world there is um some of them look at my health guys it's crazy um and you can go and collect all of them that's one of the achievements to reach maximum stamina i didn't bother so much to do it i just enjoyed playing this game i don't try to get all of the achievements or whatever and pray at all of the prey structures whatever you call it um so i just kind of i just actually just I, I played it and explored a bit but i didn't play the game as much to just get all the achievements basically because sometimes it's grinding and sometimes it makes you makes the game unenjoyable um and I really just wanted to enjoy this game. I, I waited years and years and years to play this game. Not because I couldn't afford it. It's just that I, I just played other games. Um, like the forest. I played the forest for a while. And, uh, and Conan Exiles. That's such nice games. And those games keep you busy for quite a bit. Okay, so basically all the, these holes in the grounds or temples under the grounds or, you know, will lead you bunkers, bunker, wall bunkers in the old days will lead you towards the Colossi. But you need to kind of angle your camera in such a way that you can see where the Colossi is because if it sees you it's gonna attack you and that's where the problem comes in I think we are under the Colossi no 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 not yet so where to now you just run around that corner there's another entrance and then you run, baby run. Don't think you're gonna fool this glossy guys. Ain't happening. Just ain't happening. And actually defeating this glossy is quite a challenge. I mean, oh my god. 
getting to it takes hours and hours. Well, it doesn't take hours and hours. It takes about an hour to figure out what the hell to do. Because it's raining and it's flames and God knows what. And you, you don't always see the holes in the ground, the entrances to the bunkers. You only basically see the flames coming towards you and the structures that's there for your protection. But if you don't know what to do with it, then you're stuck. You're really stuck. Oh my soul. As you can see, it took me a little while to just get on that step. But we're almost there, guys. And it feels good. It feels so good to be at the very last class. To defeat it feels even better. All right, so you just and now you're under the glossy, you're at his feet, and it will stop attacking you now, obviously, because he's a structure, he can't do anything with you being at his feet. Now to find the weak spots, because this is a huge, huge glossy, and you have no idea how many um, weak spots he has, and what do you need to do to get on top of him? It's dark, it's misty, and you don't know what to do. Me, I knew, well, I just jumped and I grabbed on that. But, um, you know, some people will try and get on from his feet up his leg. You can't. I tried it. Um, so basically you need to climb the structure and try and get on top of him. You need to get high ground to get to this glossy. It's raining. It's windy. The structure itself is moving. So it's not that difficult but guys your stamina will probably run out a few times um, as soon as you reach the top where this glossy moves a lot so um, it makes it quite challenging to get to the right spots to attack this glossy As you can see, it's quite dark, it's quite misty. If I can give you guys some advice, you know, most of us play games at night. Play this game at night, it just makes the um, graphics more impressive. And you can see better when it's dark and where you need to go. Alright, so now you're quite high flames everywhere you don't know what to expect move to the back of this glossy guys there's a weak spot attack it and then you're gonna see what's gonna happen where there's hair there's something you can attack and move on to remember guys well that's basically just common sense that you need to go there and now you just stab him in the back and he's trying to reach towards his back and now you need to jump on top of his hand and this is where the difficult part comes in guys because he's twisting his hand to check you out and while he's doing that at the right angle and at the right time you need to run towards his upper arm and believe me it looks easy right now it's not it really isn't um you need to attack him over there and then he's gonna move his other hand towards the upper part of that arm and you need to jump inside of that hand if you miss you fall all the way down you don't die though but you lose a lot 
of health now this is really difficult and it took me a while to figure out what i need to do he keeps on twisting his hand and you don't know on which side do you need to be and for you to try and hang on for dear life and get to the right part of him is very difficult so when you're on top of his hand like that attack his head even if there's no crack or whatever on that hand just attack it and he will look at it and hold it still for a few seconds to enable you to shoot his shoulder with your bow and arrow he's not going to keep it like that all the time but now he's looking at you his hand is stable you can just shoot him in the shoulder hold on and as soon as he gets close to his shoulder you jump right on top of his shoulder you don't need to attack that anymore and move towards his head and that's where the weak spot is guys and what happened to me here was i actually attacked it on his head and i fell off all the way he moved his hands so much i just couldn't get back on his shoulder again it is difficult keep you in mind your stamina you know just keep an eye on that stamina guys because you will most probably fall a few times from that second hand um, and as you can see it's quite difficult staying on top of his head and that's it guys you attack that i'm not going to tell you what happens after this glossy and that's why um I try to not give you guys any spoilers on the review preview um, that I made. Go check that out. I wanted you guys to play this game and experience it on your own with your own emotions. And I really hope you guys like my videos. And you guys need to please, please subscribe and like my channel and follow it. Um, I'm going to still play a whole lot of games. It just takes me a few, a little bit more time to create these games because I'm still, you know, working. I've got a day job. Um, so these videos only get edited and the games get played later on. Right? Alright, guys, and all you need to do is attack the top part of his um, head. Hold on for dear life. This is the last time that you need to hold on. And attack. And congratulations guys. For getting to the very last glossy. And trying to defeat it. Figure it out. You can be so proud of yourself. Takes a few steps, guys, and you don't get a lot of time. Oh, yeah, I only get a few seconds for it to stand still to enable you to attack it. It's the end, can you believe it? What will happen next? That's kind of sad to think there's no more classes left. Or is there? You guys will have to play the game and see. See what's gonna happen. guys well i hope you guys enjoyed this video please remember to subscribe and like my channel and there you go guys it's over it's done what will happen 
Will the love of your life return to life? We don't know. Go check it out. Go play the game, guys. This is Grand Ditch. Over and out.